hi guys welcome back to my channel so i'm back with another hair video and today's wig is from my first wig so this is what their box looks like as you guys can see very structured so you know for a fact that your wig is well protected and secure so this is what the wig looks like as you guys can see so this is their 14 inch 13 by 4 lace front wig so this is the construction of the wig it comes with combs comes with an elastic band already stitched onto the wig and it comes with adjustable straps at the back so this wig is actually supposed to be installed glueless so as usual the wig came pre-plucked and the hairline looks very very clean it came pre-plucked and it also came pre-bleached so all i need to do is literally just to install this wig the wig also came pre-styled as you can see so this is literally a ready to go wig so they sent me a wig grip and they also sent me a lace glue which i'm going to be trying out both for you guys in today's video so this is supposed to act as a grip for the wig so you don't have to glue it down so i'm actually going to go ahead and pop this on now and i like the fact that it's kind of like a medium brown color so you know this will definitely match my skin tone so i'm just going to pop this on okay so because the wig has already been styled as a side part and i'm gonna shift this part of the grip as you can see this side it still has some grips on it but it's not as big as you know the rest of the grip so i'm gonna switch this side to the side so you know the side parting can lay on this side and you know you'll be fine okay so now i'm just gonna go ahead and pop the wig on your wig should look something like this so the elastic band hook together and the adjustable straps in the hook at the, in the hooks at the back I'm not gonna lie to you, so I've got the wig on now, yeah, and it feels really, really secure on my head. Like, this is not going anywhere. And all I've used so far is the elastic band that comes with the wig and the straps. So this grip is basically meant to like grip onto your lace and your wig doesn't move when the wind is blowing or if someone tries to pull your wig, it's still basically secure. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and cut off the lace and then we can go from there. Actually, do you know what? I feel like since I'm doing a glueless install today and I don't want to apply um, any spray, I should apply my foundation. So I'm going to go ahead and just apply some powder. This is my powder brush and I'm just going to apply what's left on it and just apply this over the lace. Okay, so I've got the wig on now and I've cut off all the excess lace and this is what the lace looks like. As you guys can see, this is 100% glue lace. I've not applied any glue to this wig. It's literally not moving because that grip thing is there. So I have to like use so much force to like pull it back and then now stretch it out properly. I think I'll, de I'll definitely say I'm like really happy with this grip because not only can I use it for this wig, I can use it for my other wigs as well. Um, now I'm just going to go ahead and use my hot comb. You guys can see the wig already came pre-styled so... okay so i'm done adding some layers to the wig now i think this looks a lot better this is just like a i feel like this wig is just giving off a simple everyday go-to definitely very big enough friendly so guys this wig is secure on my head and it's not glued down i've not used any hairspray i've not used any hair glue i've not used mousse gel nothing so i'm gonna come in closer now so you guys can see what 
you know how the hairline looks so this is how the lace looks which is really really good by the way i think i would definitely recommend you use um your contour powder because i feel like that obviously helped with matching my forehead a lot better because that's obviously where you would bronze or contour around that area so i would recommend you use the same contour the same powder you use the contour around your forehead use that on the lace this part of the wig is fine but then obviously you know you have the sides and you know the sides are always the problem but i feel like if it was left to me i would definitely leave this wig like this and call it a day like this is like so quick and simple like it literally took me five minutes to install this wig and you can see you're still able to put your um hair behind your ear if you'd like to i'll zoom in so you can see see how the lace looks the last thing i have to show you guys now is the lace glue that they also sent me as you can see so this is what their lace glue looks like which you can obviously decide to use to install your wig if you would like to but you don't have to because you guys can see i've got this wig on my head and it's not glued down but um just to show you guys how to use the glue i'm going to glue down the air tabs but you don't have to use the glue like i said so you can either wear it glueless like this or you can decide to use any hairspray or whatever glue you'd normally use but i'm going to show you guys how to use their glue so so i've just applied a small amount of the glue and now i'm just going to use this um to just spread it out i don't even remember the last time i used um actual lace glue you know one thing I've noticed right away is that the glue does not take long to um to dry down which is a good thing so now I'm just gonna pop the lace over that glue all done and glued down so now you don't have to worry and this is still very much glueless or you've had to glue down or just the air tabs the sides okay so i finished installing this wig now i think i just like the fact that you have the option of gluing it down or you can wear it glueless it's literally up to you so um and it's like even if you do decide to wear it glueless the wig is very secure on your head you don't have to worry about you know your wig um sliding back or coming off or anything like that because you have the wig grip i would definitely recommend you um cut some layers into the wig just to give it a bit more body because when it came it was nice but i just kind of felt like the the style was like really really flat so i'm happy i decided to cut some layers into the wig because now i feel like it has more body and this looks a lot better so yeah so yeah like i said this wig is from my first wig and it is definitely very beginner friendly because it literally took me five minutes to install this wig and you can wear this wig without using any glue any hairspray any gel nothing no hair mousse nothing you can actually wear this wig and just go so yeah and the length of the wig is 14 so this is a 14 inch wig and yeah guys so i'm going to make sure to list all the links that you guys need to know down below in the description box so please make sure you check down below for anything you like to know and i'll see you guys in my next one bye